Hey, what's up guys, it's me Brandon, and today I'm doing a little bit of a room tour for you guys, so um, it's not completely done and also the lighting might not be that great, but I hope you guys enjoy, and thank you guys for watching. Okay guys, so here's my room. Now, um, I'm going to kind of go over everything and show you what it's all about. Uh, but I'm going to start with the gaming setup because I feel like that's what everything or everybody's here about. So here's my gaming setup. Um, there's my PC. So I have a triple monitor setup with a 144 in the middle, 60s on the side. I have uh, the Logitech surround sound with five speakers. So I have the one, two over here, and two over there. Really nice audio. Uh, Steel Series keyboard, and of course the Razer Death Adder mouse. Always use that mouse. Here's my recording mic. This is kind of up right now, but uh, I really like this recording mic. I've honestly been using this like basically my whole entire life, um, and it's been good to me since. But uh, I'm also using the Rode Arm Full 360. Perfect because I get the best uh, you know positions on whatever I want to sit. Now, here's my poster. I got this when I was a kid, framed it, and I just thought it would be great where it is. The clock, that I'm pretty sure. Did not say the right time. Nope, definitely not. So that's good. What else do we have? So here is my dresser. Uh, the main thing on here. Got lots of stuff. An old camera. Not like the camera I'm using now. This is actually from Cuba. It's a, uh, a bull's horn carved into a swordfish. Uh, this is something my, si my sister actually illustrated, so I keep it up here. What else do we got? Another heirloom from the family. Uh, Cuba again. My buddy put this on my desk, so I kind of just keep it here now. My trip to America, someone shot a shotgun in the air and I kept the shell. <laughs> this is a boat that I got at a garage sale for like five bucks, and I always love these type of boats. So it looks really badass, I think. Uh, my Gucci spray, I believe it's Gucci Guilty. A real 7.72 bullet, a vape that's broken, I swear to God, always leaks. This is actually a whistle. I don't even remember where I got this, but I think it was Florida, very long time ago. Um, this is a creeper that my sister crocheted for me a long, long time ago. Havana Club bottle with two shot glasses hooked on the side my lamp, and then my neighbor Totoro, little guy. Uh, over here, I have my savings jar. I kind of just put all my change in here over the past like couple months, so I, I don't keep change on me at all, so it always goes in here. Um, there's also my sub for my speakers. But then, this kind of just like a shelf for all like miscellaneous, like I got like, X or Nintendo, PS4, random, Xbox, and Vive. All that kind of stuff sorted out in there. And here's my computer, the actual inside. I didn't really go for RGB, but all the new parts do come RGB, so that's kind of cool. The whole case changes and everything. Anyways, over to my bed. My bed's uh, double, you know, with the IKEA Malm, so these drawers come out here. But uh, I'm gonna get new bed sheets because these are really old and kind of getting really gross. Uh, I kind of just made the bed for the video, but it's normally not made to be honest. Now come over here, these are my guns. They're not real, they are airsoft. Um, and I do go airsofting, I do enjoy it. Uh, I got the VSR Sniper, uh, Tokyo Mori Glock, a couple assault rifles here. And uh, actually the reason why you see the big Canadian flag, which is actually very new to my room, I think I did it yesterday. I normally just had like a yellow sheet that covered it, but the problem is, is when I stream, this is bannable, so I have to cover it because my stream setup's right here, my camera's right there, so you're gonna see that in plain sight. Originally, my setup was right here where the bed is, back when I lived here before I moved out, and you wouldn't see it, but now it's kind of a problem. Going over here, I have a light up sign. It does work. It's just not plugged in. 
because my outlet's all fucked up and I haven't really, you know, messed around with that. But I do have my board game collection right here. All the different board games I have, you know, over a year of collecting. And I do play with my family sometimes, it's kind of fun. Um, like I said, the room's not complete. I have all my alcohol here and a random NOS bottle. But I don't have a shelf or anything I can put it on yet. So that's something I'm going to have to do in the future. Probably something up here, that corner. Um, above my board games here though, I have my jewelry box with all my watches. And down below, necklaces, rings, all that kind of stuff. I am a little bit into jewelry, so that's why I have a jewelry box. Over here, this is uh, my sub for my sound bar for my TV. But I also have a giraffe here and a little Toronto Maple Leafs bear. I don't know, just kind of put it there. Um, this is my TV. I use this almost every single night. It's on a tilt. It's kind of big, so I can't really show you while doing it, but it tilts up and down and it goes a whole 180 degrees. So I can get it from any angle, so if I ever just want to sit on my computer desk and kind of watch the TV I can, lay in my bed, I can turn it, it tilts down, so if I'm laying down, it'll look more towards my face. If I'm standing up, I'm doing a workout video, tilt it straight up, boom, now it's tilted straight up, you know? Tilt that back down. Anyways, I got my remotes here for my TV. A little secret contraption box that uh, I got from Cuba. Underneath my TV here is my sound bar and then this big shelf. Now inside the shelf, if I open it up, I have a bunch of things in here. And all of, everything in my room is actually wired connected, including the smart TV, which is a 55 inch by the way. See, if you can see here, I kinda got some of my wires. Let me focus. Come on, there you go. I got a lot of fucking wires going into splitters and splitters everywhere and wires going around my whole entire bed and all the way to my computer. Everything is wired connected because I do not like doing anything wirelessly, obviously except for the GameCube. But I have my PS4 here, which is the main use I believe. Xbox One, I barely use this thing anymore, but I do want to get back onto using like Halo and stuff on stream. My GameCube, which I actually use pretty often. People come over, we'll have like Mario Party sessions and stuff. That would be really fun to like do a stream of or like a record. It's kind of hard though when it's being streamed onto my TV. Maybe I'll figure something out. I normally have my uh, my switch deck here, so I can connect my switch automatically. But it's actually in the living room night living room right now because we had a game session with a couple, couple people for New Year's. Down here, PS3, Xbox 360, my World of Warcraft collector's editions, which I love. Always keep those displayed. Down here, I have a bunch of stuff: Zippo stuff, um, my candle collection. It's actually my girlfriend's candle, but. I, I do like to burn candles sometimes, I have a couple back there. All of my GameCube, PS3, Xbox One, or Xbox, uh, all my games, hard copy games are down here. I rarely do have hard copy games anymore, so this does not really change, but I do have from the, P from the Xbox and the PS3, or sorry, from the GameCube and the PS3, I have a bunch of. Um, my camera case, but my, obviously my camera's in my hands right now, so it's just the case sits in there. Um, other than that, I got my fan here for the summer, it's not very much used in the winter right now. Uh, other than that, I do have like this extra cord here, which you guys probably were wondering what that's for. And also, if you look underneath my desk right there, red and white, to connect to my sub. That's for my um, DJ deck. I'll normally just put it right here in front of my keyboard, do my DJing, practice mixing, whatever it is. I do kind of do mixing on the side. I'm still definitely learning. I'm nowhere near professional or anything like that. But hopefully I'll bring some streams of that sometime soon. Um, I also have here my music festival wristband collection and some random shit that people gave me while I was there. I don't know who they are, but they gave this shit to me. Anyways, I got my, here let me focus a little bit better. If you guys are from Canada, you might know where these are, or Ontario rather. Solaris, which is in Toronto. Um, uh, Veld, which is also in Toronto. Ever After, which is in Kitchener, Electric Elements, which is in Wasaga, another Ele Electric Elements, Ever After, again in Kitchener, and Veld, again in Toronto. So I'm actually going to Ever After, I already have my tickets, that's in June, I'm excited for that. But uh, that's basically it, my room is not very big, but you know, it's comfortable, and uh, I enjoy it. 
I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video though, and um, tell me what you guys think in the, this, in the you know, comments, and uh, have yourselves a good day.